To get started, open a web browser and type longbeachassetmap.weebly.com. That will take you to our website here. You can scroll down to take a look at the whole thing. There's a tutorial at the bottom, our data sets, and at the top is the link to our asset map on Healthy City. Make sure to read the tips over. There's a lot of data involved here, so patience is key to success. Let's get started by clicking on the asset map on Healthy City link. It may take a moment to load up because there's a lot of data involved. And here you have displayed the various categories of data points that we uploaded to Healthy City. In the lower left hand corner here, this window allows you to look at those data points uh, listed in categories. Now you can narrow your search down here by removing one of these point legend categories at a time in order to get just what you're looking at. So you can remove all the organizations and associations, again one at a time, and then perhaps remove all of the others category and narrow it down to only what you are looking for. For more advanced users, you can come up to the services and points menu. This will bring up a new window. In this window, you'll start by removing all from the search list just to start with a clean slate. In order to access our asset map data, you'll go to the uploaded point data sets under category. Under subcategory, you'll select both BHC Long Beach Asset Map 1 and BHC Long Beach Asset Map 2. Now under specific category, you have the ability to choose which categories you would like to have displayed on your map. For the sake of this demonstration, we're going to select all the categories related to organizations and associations. So these range from ethnic, cultural, gender, to health and mental health, to marine wildlife, uh, research and education, youth character building. Once these are selected, add them to the list and submit them to the map. A few moments later, you will now have the map displaying the categories that you have selected. In this lower left hand window now you can scroll down and where it says list points you want to click show in order to display the specific information for the data points. Now you can look at specific organizations on the map and click on the resource for more information including phone number, website, email, description and so forth. <clears throat> now Healthy City can only display 25 data points, the information for 25 data points at a time. So you may want to zoom in specifically on the area you are looking at in order to get a better sense of what we have there. Okay, moving from the map back to the original site. If you'd like to search our data sets in a list format, you can do so. Keep in mind there are two separate data sets. The total amount of data points was too much to upload in one list, so we have two separate lists. Recommend opening both of them if you're going to do some looking around. And once you have them both open, notice that they're in the same format, but they have different data. Once you've been directed to one or both of the data set lists, we highly recommend using the Find feature to search for keywords or themes you're hoping to find. PC users will press the Control key plus F and then type a word. Mac users will use the Apple key plus F and then type a word you're looking for. So let's start by searching for the word counseling. It'll bring up each incident of this word in the page. So you'll see it coming up in the descriptions, you'll see it coming up in the titles, and this allows you to search and see which organizations have that word displayed somewhere in the data point set. Again, if you're looking for something specific, be sure to search it in both documents to make sure that you have made an exhaustive search for that term. Thank you very much for taking a look at our asset map data and our asset map on Healthy City. We hope it's helpful to you in your wonderful work in the community of Long Beach.